Wow! And happy Saturday! <laughs>
Let's find some school supplies. Sweet. Yeah, nice. pencil sharpeners. We could use those, yeah. Nice. Erasers. Do you actually see pencils? Haha. <laughs> this one has 24. That's a deal. Yeah. Anything with color? Do you want to get that? Those look colorful. Sorted ink, that's kind of fun. That is really fun. Maybe we can get those for the older kids and we can get some crowns for the younger ones. What? 36 pack of crowns for a dollar. Oh my goodness, look at our cart. Done. Success. We spent, what, $45, but seven of those items were just for us, not for shoeboxes. So we spent a little under 40 bucks. We're gonna go home and start to compile, put together, build. Pack. That's the word. So much stuff. Okay, so I think what I'm gonna do first is just kind of pick the things that I think I want in each box, put it in there so I kind of have an idea, and then start to see what I can actually fit. I normally just try to shove it all in. I just Perfect. <laughs> you wanna get rid of all like extra plastic and stuff too. There's no point sending extra plastic, which is already hard enough to get rid of, to a country that probably doesn't have the resources to properly take care of it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Environment. Legos. I likes it. <laughs> Whoa! That was fun. Fun. I'm gonna put younger ones, little like pencil sharpeners and erasers in this, and then the older ones, school supplies, in a fanny pack. Do you like one of these as well? Yeah, hit me. This is when you realize how much packaging comes on things. This is all just trash. Who cannot open this? There you go. Whoa, it's a lot of pencils. There you go. We got some stickers. Would you like some stickers? Yep. Fun pouch. Alrighty. I have to take a little book. I feel like this is too big. Super cute though. Alrighty. This is what I'm at right now. <laughs> Rethink this. I think I am a terminado. You're done? Yeah, I just go one and done. Hey, it actually fits without straining. These are way better than the big. Unicorn box. Come no there you go. Making me a liar cute. Not at all. Boom. Done. Ta -da, ta da ta da ta da. Now that the boxes are packed, cut out your labels. Tape them on and make sure you properly mark which age. age. So the ages are 2 to 4, 5 to 9, or 10 to 14. Place those on the box, tape them on, and you are good to go. Woo. Yay! If you have rubber bands, you can rubber band them, like if it's easier to keep them together. But once they go to the processing center, all of rubber bands come off and they get taped. So like, it's not super necessary, just if it's easier to travel. Yeah. Little overview, we've got a boy, 10 to 14, boy 5 to 9, <laughs> look at the little bear, so cute. Girl 5 to 9, that's my unicorn box, and then girl 10 to 14, so cute. And we tried to make it so like the fun things you see first. Does it look fun, Agnes? You happy? I'm happy. These are good boxes. And now you can either take them to your church or any sort of collection center around. You can always look online and find whatever's closest to you to be able to drop them off. Or if you're near a processing center, you can take them there. That's the week of Thanksgiving. You're supposed to have them done the week before. I'll have the website linked below. If you guys are interested in making a shoebox, I would highly recommend it. Give back, it's the holidays, and it's just like a good thing to do. Spread love, spread joy. Yep. Write that down. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to comment down below if you guys have ever packed a shoebox or if you are packing shoeboxes this year, or let us know what you're doing to give back this holiday season. All right, you guys are great. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. There's one boy girl, one boy girl. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> like volume. Nah. Yep. I get a little snip snip. Just cutting out the labels. My job over here. Call me a label cutting Josh. Yeah. Nice. Make sure you give this video. Whoa.